Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a very large Abercrombie try-on haul. This is probably the biggest haul I've done maybe all year and it's definitely going to be the best try-on haul. I found so many good things and now that the sales are starting, I'm posting this as the sales are starting um, and I just have this bad feeling that things are going to sell out pretty quickly. So um, I'm going to have everything linked in the description box down below. Um, I have a lot of stuff to share. I'm also going to throw in a couple things that are still available that I've had for like a couple years and I still love from Abercrombie. Um, so I will, like I said, I'll have everything linked in the description box. So let's go ahead and get started. So first up, you guys, I have so many sweaters. <laughs> I swear. I think I bought like every sweater on the website but this one I was so excited about because one thing on my list for winter that I wanted was an oversized cable knit sweater in cream and Abercrombie delivers they have one um, I purchased it immediately and then they also had this beautiful light brown color um, so I'll try on the cream one next but it is an oversized cable knit sweater it's long enough. I'm wearing leggings today with it. It is so good. As of right now, it is selling out really, really fast. So I'm going to have it linked. Um, check it out if you can. It is beautiful. Um, I'm, I think I looked and it said it was like 40% cotton, but it feels like 100% cotton. It's really nice quality. It's a little bit thicker um, and it's just really it's really nice. So I love this one. I'll come up close here so you guys can see like the actual cable knit. It is definitely oversized, but I would stick true to size in it. Um, and I'm going to throw on the cream one so you guys can see that one on. Here is the cream one on. Oh, it's so good. I actually did share an Amazon one that is very similar. Um, much less expensive, still pretty good quality, not quite as good of quality as this one. Um, I'm gonna link that one down below in case this one, by the time I post it, is sold out. Because, oh, this is like one of my favorite sweaters I think I bought all season. It's so cute. Um, and the quality is so, so good. So, like I said, I got a small in both of them and I will link them down below. So, next up is another sweater that I'm trying to share the things that <laughs> I feel like will sell out really fast first. Um, this one I have a feeling is going to go really fast. It is the softest sweater I've ever put on my body. It is so incredibly soft and cozy and comfortable. Um, so the material, they called it like the Dream Lush. It is heavenly, it is heavenly. Um, so they have a couple different versions of like the Dream Lush sweater. So this is kind of like the tunic one um, and crew neck. So it's a little bit on the longer side, great for leggings, great for lounging around in. It has like this slight fuzzy feel to it. <laughs> it literally, I wish I could just like have you feel it right now because it is so, so cozy. Um, I bought it in two colors. This is the brown color, which I last checked, it was kind of selling out fast. This is the cream color, comes in a bunch of other colors as well. It is so good. Um, I'm also going to link, they have like a slight scoop um, or almost v-neck version that is tunic length. Um, I'm going to link that one down below. And then I also bought, there is a like polo one which I have, and I'm gonna throw on that one next. Um, sizing wise, I went true to size in a size small. So this is how the small fits me. I love it, oh my gosh. I'm gonna come up close to try to share with you guys the material. Okay, so I'm hoping you can see the material. You guys, it's just so incredibly soft. I had my mom and my husband, I was like, feel this, just feel this. And they were both like, oh my gosh feels so, so soft. So highly, highly suggest any Dream Lush sweater. You won't want to take it off and you will buy multiple colors. <laughs> Next up, this is the polo version of that Dream Lush material. So cute. I absolutely love it. Um, it has little buttons with the collar and then it does have a slight like boxy slouchy fit. Um, this is the size small and this is kind of how it fits. I really, really like it. It actually hits at a nice place. So if you wanted to tuck it in to high-waisted denim, you can. Um, oh my gosh, it's just so 
dreamy. <laughs> I'm telling you, just get one piece, you will love it. Um, and then I wanted to mention these. These are the high rise 80s mom jeans that I really love. I've shared these before. This is the black. I go true to size in them. They are definitely like slouchy and very relaxed. Um, they're very comfortable and I love them. I go true to size in these. Like I said, I get a 26 short and that is how they fit. Okay, next up is another like polo sweater option. I saw this one and thought it was super, super cute. I think it's called like the Notch Polo Sweater. I can't remember what it's called, but I really, really like it. I think it's super, super cozy. Um, it's not like that Dream Lush material where it's like, I don't even know what this is made of. It's so soft, but it is super super soft still it kind of has that like stretchy soft feel um it is ribbed i love this taupe color but it does come in other really pretty colors as well including like a really pretty dark brown um and i was a little worried that it would go too low here but it actually hits me at a good spot um and the collar is a little oversized like that Super, super cute. It hits kind of at the same spot as the other polo one, so I can easily tuck it in tie-waisted jeans here. I went with a size small, I went true to size. I feel like the arms are a little long, um, so I, I could size down one to the extra small, but I kind of like the slouchy look. So it depends on what you like. If you want it to kind of be less slouchy, maybe the arm's a little shorter, maybe size down one, um, but if you like the oversized, Fit like this then I would stick true to size so super super cute and I will link it down below next up is this crew neck sweater and I think it's called like the matte chenille crew neck um, so it is a chenille material um, I have a little explaining to do on this because I'm really confused but I got the black in the taupe, which I'm gonna share the taupe next. So this one is exactly how I thought it was gonna be. They came out with like a chenille material last year that was really thick, really soft, really comfortable. Um, and that is what this is. It is super, super soft, kind of thicker, kind of squishy, and really well made. I love it. However, this one does run a little small. Um, I ordered the small and the medium. This is the medium. Um, so I prefer it just for length purposes. I don't have a long torso. I'm actually pretty short. Um, I'm 5'2 and I have a short torso and I did size up one. Um, so I personally think size up one in this one. Um, but only in the black <laughs> because the taupe is actually a completely different material and a completely different like not style but it's just totally different it's so weird um, and I don't know there's other colors too I don't know how the other colors are gonna be but the black one I just want to share it's the chenille material I think you should size up one mostly for the length purposes if you go true to size it's gonna be quite cropped um, but it is super, super cozy, so cute. Um, I'll come up close so you guys can see the material. It's just like that thick chenille material that um, Abercrombie has had, and I love the crew neck. So, so classic looking, um, but like I said, size up one. So this is the taupe one, which is a completely different material and even kind of different cut than the black one that I just heard. Like, the, like I said, that black one, I sized up to a medium. This one is a small, it is a little bit longer, and the material is not chenille, it's actually like a knit sweater. It is actually the same material, this is the Notch Polo one that I just shared. It is the exact same material and color as this. So I don't know what happened, <laughs> but just so you know, when you go on the website and you're like expecting a taupe chenille sweater, it's more like a knit. It's very, very soft, very, very, very soft and cozy. Um, and I actually like the fit of this one better um, than the other one. But I also, if you size up one, the fit is really good on the black one, um, but this one runs true to size. So whatever you want to do, <laughs> whatever color you'd like, just know that the taupe one is different than the black one, and I don't know about the other colors, so I don't know what you're going to get. Um, if you can, I would just maybe grab um, your size and maybe one up, just in case, but super, super cute. I'll even come up close so you guys can see the material. Um, it's just kind of like a ribbed 
really soft knit. Um, so I love, 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 love this one. I really also like the black one, um, but the black one you do need to size up on. All right, next up, another amazing sweater, you guys. Clearly, I was attracted to their tote material that they put on every single style of sweater that they have, but it is so good. Um, I'm really, really loving the taupe color, and this one is a tunic length, kind of oversized turtleneck. It is so soft. It is so buttery. I love it. I love this one so much. Um, I actually bought it in two colors, and I'll share the, the other color next, um, but it's definitely tunic length. You can wear it with leggings. It's a little oversized. I got a size small in it. Um, oh my gosh, it's so soft and cozy. And if anything, if you like kind of the turtleneck look and you hate when it's itchy, this one is so soft, it doesn't bother me. Um, and it doesn't come up too high either. It actually sits at a nice spot right there. So, oh, love, love, love this one. And I'll show you the other color. So here's the other color, which is actually a striped version. Um, it comes in a bunch of other colors as well, but you guys, it is so good. They like nailed it with the material and the sweater styles. They just killed it this year. Abercrombie, good job. I love it. Um, this one's kind of like an off-white, maybe like a white with a black stripe. Um, so that's kind of what it looks like. So, so cute. Love this one. All right, next up is another sweater. You guys, it's so soft. I, I think that's why I love this haul so much is because every single sweater I got is so buttery and so soft and so cozy and i've been purchasing a ton of other sweaters from other retailers and it's like pins and needles it's like so itchy i actually just got an order in from h&m i got like eight sweaters and every single one felt like needles going into my body and this is just so nice it is so so good um so this one is a like half zip um so cute i loved the color of it i thought the color was really pretty it does come in a couple other colors as well um it is tunic lengths so you can wear it with leggings i got a true size small in this one so it fits true to size it is like butter on your body it is so soft um it's a bit on the thinner side it's not super thick and heavy um but it is super super soft so i love 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 this one Highly, highly suggested. I also just wanted to mention this chenille cable knit cardigan. Um, I've noticed it's on sale and it's fully in stock. It does run quite oversized. You can kind of see I got the size small. If you don't want it as oversized, I would size down one. Otherwise, if you like the oversized look, um, it is super, super cozy and comfy. The color is beautiful. I love the cable knit on it. It's really soft and squishy. And I just wanted to mention it one more time. All right, next up is this cozy Sherpa pullover. I loved it. Um, it does come in a couple of other colors as well. This one is, I think they call it light brown, but to me it's more like a creamy color, like a maybe like a very light beige, um, but I love it. It is so, it's very fuzzy and Sherpa-y. And then on the inside here, it's actually like a micro fleece. So it's super soft, extremely warm. Um, this is kind of how it fits. I went true to size with a size small. Um, I love all the little details right here. It's like, um, faux leather, um, black faux leather. So I love all the details. Also have, has little pulls so you can tie it tighter. Super, super cute and cozy. I love this one. All right, next up is one of their like asymmetrical fleece pullovers that are very popular. If you don't own one of these yet, they are so good. Um, they're so great to just throw over. A lot of times I'll do my workout early in the morning and then I'll throw this on to go do like school drop-offs and stuff or whatever just hanging out running errands and it is so warm um it's just a great throw on i have this one right here and then i actually just got this one it's the all black one and it has like a faux leather quilt up here um and underneath the sleeve here super super cute i go true to size with a size small um and it goes great with leggings it's just a really great throw on I highly suggest it. Next up is this long sleeve boyfriend tee. It is so soft. I love it. I love the fit of it. It's kind of oversized um, and definitely tunic length. So you can wear it with leggings here as a side slit on the side. Um, so this is called the dark brown color. To me, it is more of a rust red color than a dark brown personally um but it does come in other colors as well and i keep 
I feel like I keep saying this about things, but I would sleep in this. It is so soft. Like it is so incredibly soft. Um, a great, great layering piece and definitely, definitely one to check out. I, like I said, I got a size small, true to size. And then I also wanted to share this beanie. I've shared this one before. I actually grabbed it in the black too, which I can throw on, but I love it. It's so cute. I love the little fuzz ball on top. Great quality and a great stocking stuffer too to grab. Um, so I just wanted to share that too. Next up, I have this boyfriend sweatshirt. <laughs> Moving on from the t-shirt to the sweatshirt. Um, this one does not have a slit on the side. It's obviously sweatshirt material. Super, super soft and cozy on the inside, fleecy. It feels almost like worn in. It's really, really good. Um, I can't remember the color name of this, but there was only one or two other their color options in the sweatshirt but it's really really good if you have not tried their sweatshirts I say this in like every Abercrombie video definitely grab one of their sweatshirts they're really good um, and then this is the length you can wear it with leggings I went with my true size small in it and I love it and then I also want to share this is the black beanie I love it so cute Next up, I grabbed one of their boyfriend flannel shirts. I love it. It is great with leggings. It's a little bit on the longer side. I feel like in the past their flannels have been a little bit shorter, but this year they did it a little bit on the longer side, so it goes great with leggings. Um, if it's true to size, I got a size small, and I really love this print for the holidays. So fun. They have so many different plaids for the holidays too, um, and this is the one I got. It's so pretty and super, super soft as well, so I will link this one down below. I want to share this sweater set that I have shared before. It is so cozy and comfy. I love it. This is like my weekend wear. I also own it in the cream. I go true to size with a size small for the sweater and then the sweater joggers I go with an extra small. They come separate so you can buy different sizes which is great. I have also worn the sweater with like jeans and stuff and it looks super super cute and the material is just so soft and luxurious. I love it, so good, and I will link it down below. Next up, I got one new outerwear piece. Um, I'm also gonna share some of my older outerwear pieces. I love their outerwear, it is so good. It lasts so nicely, and there's some really, really great classic pieces. Um, this is my newest one, however, I need to exchange the size for it, so I really love it. It's kind of like a shorter, dad coat but it was a really really pretty like tweed herringbone oh it's beautiful it actually reminds me of a really nice mango coat that i had my eye on um but i grabbed this one however um you can kind of see the fit it is definitely oversized it's meant to be oversized but they do carry a petite version and I think that one would flatter me a little bit better. Um, this one's a little long um, for a short kind of boxy coat. I need it to hit like right here. Um, it's just a little too long on me. I want it to fit a little bit shorter, but it is beautiful. Um, if you're petite, if you always kind of order like short and pants um, on Abercrombie, I would go the petite route on this jacket. If you are maybe like 5'4 and taller, I would go with the regular, um, but it is so pretty. I love it. Um, this is the size small regular, if I didn't say that already, and I'll come up close so you guys can see the detailing. All right, so here is the detailing on it. it so pretty, very, very well made, um, but again, just sizing is a little off for me on this one. Next up, I'm gonna share a couple of coats I have from the past. Um, the faux leather puffer is such a good one. Highly suggest it. This color isn't available. I actually think this color is available in the faux fur though. Um, it comes in black, a ton of other colors. They are so good. I go true to size in them um, and I can fit a pretty thick sweater underneath and still be comfortable. So I go true to size with a size small. It's a little bit on the shorter side, but I love these coats. They are very, very popular for a good reason. Next up is their Sherpa Teddy Coat, such a popular one too. Um, this color isn't available anymore. I think it comes in a bunch of different colors. This one is actually from like two or three years ago. So cozy. Um, this is the shorter one. They have longer version ones now, but I'll link the shorter one because it's one of my favorites. Such a good one. I still wear it to this day and it's held up so nicely. All right, last coat I wanted to share is the classic dad coat. This one is one of my favorites out of all my coats because it's just so classic looking. I will have this in my closet for a very long time. 
The quality is beautiful. The color is beautiful. The fit is perfect. Um, I go true to size with the size small. I can fit thicker sweaters underneath. It's just a classic go-to for me. If you don't have a camel coat in your closet, this one is definitely worth looking into. All right guys, so that is it for the largest Abercrombie haul I maybe have ever done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did like it. Stay and subscribe if you're not, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.